Hello children, welcome to AVS class. I am back with our new topic. Before we start our new topic, let me ask you few questions. Do you eat food? What food you eat? Why do you eat food? From where do you get food? Let me answer. Yes, we all eat food. We take breakfast in the morning and in that breakfast we eat poha, upma, idli, dosa, cheese sandwich. Then we drink milk, tea, coffee, juice. Sometimes we eat fruits. Then in the afternoon we take a lunch and for lunch we eat roti, sabzi, dal, rice, salad and at night we take a dinner and in that dinner we eat same food as roti, sabzi, dal, rice, salad and sometimes soup. Non-vegetarian people eat eggs, chicken, mutton, uh, fish and these food items give us energy. Food gives us energy to do our daily activities. So, food is very very important for our body. And from where do we get food? We get our food from plants and animals. So, plants and animals are, are sources of food. So, our today's topic is sources of food. Sources of food are plants and animals. We get our food from plants and animals. So, today we will learn food that we get from plants. Let's start. Food from plants. We get food from stem, leaves, roots and fruits of a plant. Sugar cane is a stem which we eat. We eat the leaves of spinach and cabbage. Carrots and beetroots are roots. We eat them as salad. We get fruits like mangoes, apples, banana, oranges from plants. We get cereals like wheat, rice from the plants. Chapatis are made from wheat. We also get pulses like kidney beans, green grams, chickpeas from plants. We get nuts like almonds, cashews, walnuts from plants. Plants also give us herbs like coriander and mint. We also get spices like turmeric, red chilli and pepper from plants. Herbs and spices add flavor to our food. So children, today we learnt about source of food, plants. And I hope you all have understood the importance of plants. In the next video, we will learn about source of food, animals. Till then, bye. See you in the next class.